The treatment of acute heart failure or left ventricular failure is very important. It's a very common topic for exams and the clinical practice. You will see it everywhere all the time. The patient presents with symptoms of pulmonary overload. They will have shortness of breath and this quickly exacerbates if the patient does any effort. It's basically pulmonary congestion. So all of this fluid that is inside the lung has to go out. So if you see the symptoms of left ventricular failure or heart failure, remember the sequence of the alphabets LMNOP. L for Lasix, which is pyrosomite, and this is perhaps the most important medication to give to these patients. It's a diuretic and it will decrease the fluid levels in the blood and the intravascular volume and will excrete this fluid into the urine. So less fluid means less congestion and less symptoms. Often these patients will also have some chest pain or acute chest pain for which we give them morphine. Nitrates can also be useful because they increase the flow into the heart and this works sort of as a rejuvenation for the heart muscle. It increases the blood supply and increases the heart muscle's function. The patient has to be sitting up and this allows the excess fluid in the lungs to go down into the abdomen and to the lower limbs. And while they're sitting up, we should give them oxygen. Oxygen is important because they will have shortness of breath and we want to use all of the volume of the lungs that we can. And they have to take deep breaths to fill out all their lungs. So that's simply the treatment of acute heart failure. It is very, very important. And the sooner that you start the treatment, the better the results. Use the link below to get access to the full mnemonics course. In this course, we will discuss all the important high yield topics that we see everywhere in the clinical practice. These topics are especially important for healthcare providers. We cover topics like the treatment of acute heart failure, tension pneumothorax, and other